Hello, my beautiful Taurus. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel, Trying Divine Tarot. I'm trying, and I will be doing a general reading for you today. <laughs> please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I greatly appreciate that. And please don't forget to hit that notification bell. It lets you know every time I upload a video. Okay. We're going to start out with two oracle and see what the overall energy is. Overall energy for my beautiful Taurus angels. One more for my beautiful Taurus. Whoa, did you see that? <laughs> okay, we have fire. Ooh, something very passionate and exciting. Or maybe you're going to a bonfire this weekend, or maybe you've been invited to like a like an outdoor event, like a bonfire or something. Okay, it says, let go of emotional upheaval and embrace the renewal of the present. Okay, whatever doesn't serve you, Taurus, throw it in the fire, okay? <laughs> okay, and then we have the fool here. So a brand new opportunity, a brand new beginning. I believe that you closed out chapters. I think you did what you had to do. And I'm feeling like that energy of mission complete. Okay, so now you're on the next leg of the journey. And you're right in the beginning phases. But I think that you're extremely excited about it. And um, you're not feeling any sort of like red flag or anything. You're just like going to go for it. Okay, and that's what you're being guided to do. This is a brand new beginning. Okay, have the courage to embrace change and take risks and be adventurous so that's what i'm feeling like a new adventure for my taurus okay and we're going to do a few uh, kippers then i'm going to clarify with the tarot i'm feeling 2023 has its had its ups and its downs but i feel for taurus that it's been better than previous years okay for you <laughs> Um, let's see. Okay. We have courthouse. Okay. I don't know. Maybe you were dealing with some legalities here. Maybe you had to go to court for something. Maybe you received a victory in court, but these are legal papers. You please clarify fire and fool. Okay. <laughs> then we have main female. Okay. So she's holding a red rose. So somebody's making a love offer. A brand new love offer. Okay. <laughs> Somebody that holds a lot of passion for you and may have been hiding their feelings, okay? They may be a friend of a friend with these white roses here or somebody, you know, that you know platonically, okay? Well, they want to come in now and they want to give you the red rose, okay? And not only the red rose, okay, but I think they want to <laughs> move this along in a very speedy fashion and maybe take you right to the courthouse. But we don't know. We'll see. <laughs> I just feel maybe, Taurus, you're at that point where you want to be in a committed relationship. You want to be married, okay? Yeah. Yeah. What did I just say? And here it is. It fell right <laughs> This is the four ones, okay? This is being in a very ha happy, healthy relationship. Um, it's definitely the card of action, okay, with the four of wands. Anytime you see wands here, or it would be in the regular Rider Waite deck, okay? But it represents stability, it represents a brand new home, a brand new home with somebody that you love, okay? 
something very exciting and passionate because it's wands and something that's happening because it's wands. Okay. So, um, somebody's going to be coming in very soon and I don't know if they're verbally going to approach you or they might send you flowers with a little note. Somehow you are going to be receiving a message or information. It might come in the, the form of a letter though, okay? So watch your mailbox. I'm also getting the feeling that if somebody, somebody may have tried to send something to you but it was sent to your wrong address and you may have somebody holding information from you that is not theirs but I feel like they had already opened this letter and read its contents and they're keeping it from you, okay? So just be aware of that. Let's see. Someone's in love with you, Taurus. They feel this when they think of you. They might think that you're that you're that you are their twin flame, okay? Fire is a major energy. All right. What else for Taurus? Someone wants to tell you that they, they choose you, Taurus. They choose you. And if that means that they have to go and get the go to the courthouse and get the paperwork to prove how dedicated they want to be, then that's what they're gonna do. Okay. They these might be like those marriage papers or a marriage license. Like somebody is already cooking this up, okay? And they're gonna have it all cooked up. They might even be offering you, you know, like they want to move in together. They may have even purchased a brand new home. That's how certain they are that you are their person. Okay, Taurus. <laughs> what did you do? All right. I, you're, you're dealing with somebody very mysterious and you're dealing with somebody that's, I'm feeling like a magician. Okay. That has something really special planned for you. And their approach may be a little unorthodox. Okay. <laughs> oh, it came out. Okay. <laughs> we have mature man. So this little mature man has been following us through your readings. Okay. I think I recalled him coming out. A couple times so for this I am probably going to um, this is a mature person okay they're not gonna play any games with you they know what they want and they want it now okay with him with his finger and um, pointing like this is this is what it's gonna be this is how I feel and like I said, he's not interested in playing any games. He's mature. And he might have been interested in you for a really long time. And like I said, he may have tried to get in touch with you somehow, some way. It was like intercepted. That's what I feel like. He sent it to the wrong address. He sent it to the wrong email address. Something along that. It's like I'm feeling lost in translation here, okay? Okay. And one more. We have Distant Horizons. So there's something very, very magical coming in for you Taurus okay something that's gonna release you of anything that's been binding you or keeping you stuck or keep, it's really gonna pull that anchor up and you're gonna be able to to move to the place where you're supposed to be okay something that's not restricting okay and it's something and I don't know. I just feel like Taurus, you were really like, re restricted some way or some. 
some way, shape, or form. That's a pretty big anchor. But as you see, it's being pulled up. And you're going to be allowed to move to your destiny. Okay? And it's looking really good. With This is one of the happiest cards in this deck. Okay? This might as well be the sun card. All right. <laughs> Let's get a few tarot on this. Somebody might have been create, creating illusions for you, Taurus. You could have felt like somebody was trying to play with you. And they were, okay? You were correct in thinking that. You are correct in having your guard up. And you are good um, for protecting yourself against whatever this was. I don't know where that came from. It just I needed to say it. I feel like somebody was tampering with your mail. I don't know why. I'm just getting that a strong feeling that somebody was tr like tampering with your mail or broke into your emails or social medias. Excuse me for it. I don't know. I think you caught them doing it. Like you have evidence that somebody was doing this to you. Or maybe you had to somehow get the authorities involved. Or maybe you spoke to somebody regarding an issue to where you felt like things were being tampered with. And behind the scenes, somebody was helping you. Or I don't know where I'm getting that. Okay. <laughs> um, I just feel like you're very, very protected at this time. Like, if you had to get the authorities involved for whatever reason, they're on your side because you provided some evidence that, you know, backed you up, you know, and they can't ignore that. So, I don't know. I just feel like something like that is in the works, too. And I also feel like somebody was tampering with your information, whether it be your, you know, your social medias or your mailbox, and you know, like your, where you get your mail. All right, we have the Empress here. Okay, so somebody is very, very fond of you, Taurus. This is your card. You represent the Empress. You and Libra. Okay, Libra is here in this card because um, the Empress embodies all the queens. She's a uh, um, She's balancing all her elements. She's balancing fire. She's balancing water. She's balancing earth. She's balancing air. Okay? She's abundant. And everything she does, she's creative. She's loving. She's kind. She's nurturing. Not only to, you know, the human race, but to our little animal race too, you know? <laughs> to, to the little worldly creatures, to everything. She's, she's very loving and kind. And you're radiate, radiating this energy and you're calling in, I believe, your counterpart, okay? Or maybe your twin flame here. Or people really recognize you, okay? She's the catch. She's the one everybody wants to be with. She has a lot of... She has a lot of options, okay? But, you know... She only wants her match. And she doesn't play games either. Like this guy. They don't play games. They're too mature for that. All right. I also feel, Taurus, you did something to outsmart your haters. Okay. 
I don't know why I have to keep going back to what I just said about that um, somebody being tampered with, but somehow you caught them, you have some sort of evidence or, or whatever the case is. I just feel like people that thought they were getting over on you, you handled it you, and like you outsmarted your haters, whatever you did, okay? <clears throat> and you might have somebody that was tampering with you illegally like I said when you mess with somebody's mail that's a that's a felony okay and like I said you might have caught them do that you may have had to report somebody or somebody if you were concerned about this somebody you confided in decided to go behind the scenes and help you out okay and like Maybe they got the th authorities involved and you're being protected and you don't even know it, okay? But I feel like you can feel this. <laughs> and whoever was really trying to bring you down might be headed to jail, okay? Because there's like, I'm saying that this is like, whatever was done to you, like tampering. I'm hearing like tampering... They could have tampered with legal documents, okay? And I don't know how far this goes. Maybe somebody signs your name to something. Somebody... I'm hearing identity theft. All these things, okay? Um, and whoever was doing it was caught. And I believe that they could find themselves headed to court or headed to jail. Something you did, I don't know if to protect yourself, I don't know what you were doing, but you outsmarted them. Okay, Taurus, you outsmarted them and and now justice and karma, you're going to be able to witness it play out. This truth was just spoken here. That's a yes. That's a yes. Okay, so... Their little plan to just to disrupt your life or to you know sabotage or whatever it's not working. It may have seemed to them that it was working in the past, but that was just the higher power giving them enough rope to hang themselves because now they're caught and Karma's the bitch. Oh, she could be an evil bitch sometimes, and I feel like that's the bitch that they're going to encounter. Okay, so <laughs> you, on the other hand, Taurus, you're on to brand new, beautiful, exciting beginnings here. Two guards, two different decks. There's a lot of passion. Something that's going to make you really, really excited you're going to feel like a winner, okay? You're going to feel like you won something. I'm just feeling you're going to be really, really lucky in love really, really soon here, okay? And whatever this situation is, like I said, you're going to be able to toss that in the fire, okay? <laughs> and move on to your brand new beginning. Look at it. We're just repeating yourselves now with the fool. You're on to your next quest. And you feel really, really good about it because you give a really good feeling. Oh, look it. This just came out too. I told you about a little message. Prepare yourself for a very, very, um, with the wand here. It's a very happy message you're going to be receiving. It's going to be short and quaint, but it's going to make you happy. And it's going to get, um, it's going to raise your spirits, I feel, okay? So, oh yeah, it wants to come in. It flipped out, flipped, flipped back in. It, that was the, the Knight of Swords. So this is somebody that wants to come in quickly and they have something to say. Or you'll be receiving... This new little message very, very shortly. 
One more for Taurus, please. Okay, look, you heard it. I don't know if you saw it. It didn't drop yet. I know what I was saying was right, okay? <laughs> the Two of Cups. The Two of Cups is here for my beautiful Taurus. So this is a love connection. It could be a twin flame connection. We have two flames here. I know I said that in the beginning. I think your twin flame is making their way towards you. This is someone you can trust, someone that's mature, someone that doesn't want to play any games. They might be a little bit older than you. That's all right. Here it is too. Okay. They want to have it all with you. This is the wish fulfillment card, 1111. If it, you haven't heard news of this uh, just yet, it's on its way. So keep your your eyes and your ears peeled, okay? <laughs> All right, this seems really, really beautiful for Taurus. I'm gonna leave it here. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I would greatly appreciate that. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. It lets you know every time I upload a video. And until next time, baby dolls, ciao.